product of choice. We think this is the right product for the open web platform. We think this is the right product for WebRTC. We are trying to get this in as many hardware places as possible across Android, across Chrome, making this hardware accelerated, getting the best performance for screen sharing, for HD, for 4K. Uh, VP8 is the codec you know, of now, and we, want to, we are gonna make sure that you know, it's successful for people who are using it. Um, so H.264, some folks have asked us, <laughs> so, <laughs> so I, I just mentioned the, the position that we have, but some, uh, we, we, some folks have asked us, well, can I submit a patch to add H.264 into the WebRC code base? And you know, we're not idiomologues here. So when there's a patch, we're working on integrating it. You know, if you want to ship H.264 support where you bring your own H.264 from Joe's H.264 store, um, then, then you're certainly welcome to do that, and we will have the packetization support in WebRTC, the negotiation support, where you know that can work, but it won't be in Chrome. So if you want to build your own, if you want to build your own, you know, application using the WebRTC source code, this will be, you know, H.264 can be supported. You can integrate it very easily. But as I mentioned, we think VP8 is the right choice for the web platform. But we think the even better choice, starting next year will be VP9. And we hand it over to Pangu to kind of regale us on. Was that a great. subtle date that both of them were in black and white and this is in color? Mm. Oh, um, it's, you know, <laughs> nine. It's, it's at least 1.25 times better.